Okay, it's demo time for the eye. So I would start with an eye primer. I love our eye primer. It really helps the um, eye products stay on. So it is kind of like a skin tint. So you just want to smear that up on there. And so everybody knows, it's no secret, that I have a love of this palette one and there it is and as you can see I like to use this color this color and this color a lot this gold is another favorite I don't know how well you can see that but we're gonna start with this brush I use a flat brush this is actually a bare minerals brush and I just start all over the eye so I'm gonna use this little mirror here this is sincere out of that palette and it kind of has a little bit of a gray finish to it. But as you can see, it's got a lot of shimmer and sheen in it. So we're going to do both eyes at the same time. And as you can see, I really lay it on there. Okay, so there's what we get. A little shimmer. Almost looks like a um, splurge cream, doesn't it? Okay, next is Chipper. I'm going to use this color right here, Chipper. I love this color. So I kind of go in and lay it on the lid, that Chipper, and go ahead and hit what would be your natural crease. If you have really deep set eyes and you lose a lot of that crease because of the lid, just go up a little higher to create that crease um, to give yourself a little bit of eye definition. So that is that. Get here where you all can actually see what I'm doing instead of being off to the side. Okay, so that is step two for the eyes. So this is kind of what you get. You get this look here. Okay, backing off. You can see it doesn't look as scary as it does close up. That's what you've got. Alright, and then I use this is actually the second brush that I just used um, was our eye brush. This is their eye definer brush. This is from Unique. And then this is actually an e.l.f. brush. This is called the C brush. It's $3 at Target. And it's kind of flat and thick. And it is so good for like hitting this outer corner. So you want to hit this outer V area right here. It kind of makes a V like this. So I'm going to go in with that really dark color and hit that V. I'm trying to make it a little more dramatic so you all can actually see. Okay, you can see that. And what I'm using is Forthright, this color right here. It's like a matte brown. I use that a lot. I tend to, I like mattes and shimmers. I'm not picky. So, I know what your next question is going to be. So, how do you get that to look normal? Well, you know what I do? I go back with the first brush that I used, which was this one, my Bare Minerals. This is a light stroke brush from Bare Minerals. I've had this for probably 10 years. And if you're wondering what I do, I wash my brushes with um, one of two things. Bare Minerals does have a brush cleaner, which I do use sometimes. But more recently, I have some um, salon grade shampoo, and I use salon grade shampoo and conditioner on my brushes and then I just lay them out to dry and you should clean your brushes about once a week maybe no more than once every two weeks to keep bacteria off of those so then what we do is I go back with um, either this original color I use sincere or elated which is like a real light I don't know it's like a light pale white and then you want to start at this corner and you want to blend all this to the outer corner so that makes everything look like an artist would do it. So see how much softer that looks compared to that? You get this versus this. So there's there's the look you get. So you want to go back and blend that again. Just blend it from the corner out so you're actually blending all those colors. And 
and that's what you get. And if one side looks a little bit darker than other, which this one kind of looks a little bit darker, you can go back in and add a little bit more, or you can just go back in and tone this one down a little bit. So there we go. There's an eye tutorial. That's what you get. Still got my flawless face on, and um, we're going to move right on. All right, girls, you all have a good evening, and that is your eye tutorial with palette number one, the browns. Thanks.